Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm really excited because this is one of my very first Just Talk commentary series videos that I've ever done. I've never actually made a commentary video before. Uh, some YouTubers that I've seen do commentary videos. And this is going to be about the Just Dance series, um, one of the most popular Just Dance games in the whole entire world. And yeah, let's get started, shall we? So uh, if you like what you see about these commentary videos, please let me know down below. Um, I'll try to like re read one of your comments and see if I can do better on my next commentary video. So let's get started. Let's talk about the update JD content creator guidelines. It's like a set of rules um, for what you can and cannot upload to YouTube regarding Just Dance gameplay. And this is probably much uh, similar to the Ubisoft content creator policy, but like in a Just Dance simplified version. Just Dance on Twitter tweeted about the updated con content creator guidelines and the replies are not what it seems. There were some people liking about the new content creator guidelines and then like most people not liking the um, content creator guidelines. And I kind of have to to agree on the left side. All, all content must be like very like original like you can't have full gameplay only videos about uh just dance that's like ripping their entire 10 10 years of content that have that they have been creating for they have like put in put in their time to like um create those costumes and then record and then edit and then like publish it for everyone to play on most consoles like that I'm gonna read over to you the the Just Dance content creator guidelines that um, Just Dance has posted on their news page. So let's get right into it. Greetings, dancers. There have been some questions regarding what Just Dance content is acceptable to upload to YouTube, so we are here to clarify. All Just Dance content must comply with the official Ubisoft video policy, which you can read more about it here. This means uploading full gameplay only videos is not allowed under any circumstances. So if you upload full gameplay only videos that is not allowed, um, it, must, it must be original. The following are guidelines for all Just Dance video content, so let's go over them. So here are the do's. If game has not yet released, you can release videos of yourself dancing to the 60 second officially released previews. If your video includes gameplay, please be sure to also include the corresponding 60 second preview as released by Ubisoft. So, so meaning when, when the next Just Dance game like, is almost arriving, there is like a 60 second preview to a song. You can make that to, to like yourself dancing to the 60, 60 second preview. This is how the video is supposed to be. The pink square is you dancing along to the um, 60 second preview, which is the, the small blue box. If the game has released already, you may post videos of yourself playing with no gameplay on the screen, I have seen like everybody do this on YouTube, including myself, because I want to be um, to be seen by everyone uh, dancing. If you do include gameplay in your video, the gameplay must be no larger than 20% of the screen. Previously, in their blog posts, before Just Dance 2021 was um, still a thing, previously they said it was like 25%, now it has been degraded to 20% of the screen which i don't think it's like a big of a difference between like like 25 and 20% percent. It's, it's still small they also added here videos must contain added entertainment value such as you dancing along 
So, so like if you do include gameplay video, um, be sure to also like include yourself dancing. And I don't think it's uh, very much a big deal. Some people in the Just Dance community are really shy to put themselves out there. And I agree that probably most Just Dancers that I know don't want to um, be, be seen like showing themselves on on YouTube, like mainly due to privacy reasons. But that is the takeaway of the Just Dance community. People out there like wanna like upload full gameplay only videos. They wanna only do the scoring part of the um, the GD routines and not showing themselves doing the full choreography. Like I have seen a lot over the past few years. Let's go over the don'ts. If the game has not yet released, please do not post the full routine of a song even when the song has been announced, unless specifically solicited by Ubisoft. I have seen on YouTube recording these um, full gameplay only videos at E3 during the Just Dance event. For any event footage prior to release, focus must be on stage presenters and not gameplay screen. And then it says here, please do not release any videos containing songs that have not yet been announced. If the 60 second preview is not already on an official Ubisoft channel, then it will be considered an infringement of intellectual property rights and it will be treated at, as leaked content. I remember when, like, before Just Dance 2019 was released and it was like only like a few days before the official release of the Just Dance 2019 game, someone tried to leak the full gameplay of, of the No Tears Left to Cry song. Some people in that video were like really upset. So then Ubisoft started to like take down uh, the video of the full, full gameplay of No Tears Left to Cry. And Just Dance has started to like post post the um, officially released preview and also the teasers on Instagram and Twitter. And believe me, it was like kind of like a little bit of a, a mess that the full gameplay was like spoiled for like everyone, and so um, they had to like do something about about that video that I have taken down. If the game has been released, please do not upload raw gameplay footage. Full, full gameplay needs to be no larger than 20% of the screen. Please do not upload gameplays with no added entertainment value, even if the gameplay is within 20% of the screen. If only gameplay is shown, the video will be considered a violation and will be taken down. That has only been a thing before Just Dance even like reached out to content creators about this change. Let's go over regarding modded content. In accordance with Section 7 of Ubisoft's Terms of Service, modding of Just Dance content is not allowed unless permission is expressly given by Ubisoft. And here's an excerpt from Ubisoft's Terms of Service. It says that you may not copy, reproduce, distribute, republish, download, perform, display, post, transmit, exploit, create derivative works or otherwise use any of the materials in any form or by any means without the prior written, written authorization of us or the respective copyright owner which may be granted at its sole discretion. This means any content uploaded to YouTube that contains any assets from Just Dance games without the express permission from Ubisoft will be considered a violation and will be taken down. Modded versions of the game, whether given for free or sold, will be considered copyright infringements and the creator may have legal action taken against them. Selling modded versions of like the Just Dance game is pro probably very dangerous and pro probably you're, you're gonna have like a jail time or something like that. I am not even sure. But um, please be aware um, for modders out there, like, like you can't you can't mod the the game or something like that because like it's like again just dance has like put their time and effort for a lot of assets um to to be in the game and to to not be like 
given to like two people who who want to make their own versions of the game. This was back to when Just Dance 2017 was made available on Steam, and I have um, seen like very few people um, making mods of the game. But then it says here regarding fan mates, fan made deals must be wholly original content. Any use of elements obtained from Just Dance games without permission will be considered a violation and will be taken down. What they're trying to say is like, if you make any like real elements of like the, the Just Dance assets, um, then that then that deal will be taken down. Making your own Just Dance elements over on Illustrator or Photoshop or, or any like Adobe programs or f or video editing software um, will work and it does not affect the um, content creator guidelines. So I guess if you're part of the Just Dance squad team, you're able to use the assets provided by the Just Dance team. And honestly, I haven't seen like um, Just Dance making a return with like the Just Dance squad signups. I really, really want to um, uh, sign up for the Just Dance squad to um, be part of their family. And that's it for for this topic, um, I really enjoyed uh, watching full gameplay only videos before, but like now that Just Dance has addressed the content creator guidelines, um, we all must comply with the um, with with their rules so that we don't um, get our videos taken down. And making gameplays like this is not that hard. If you want to be like out of the box, like all, all you gotta do is like follow, follow these rules and like uh, dance along to the gameplay and you should be good to go. I I really, I really love to see all of your faces dancing to the Just Dance gameplay. If you enjoyed my first commentary video, be sure to give it a like and subscribe uh, to my channel. That way I can like improve one of my uh, next commentary videos. And yeah, I'll see you guys all later in my next commentary video of Just Talk. Bye!